Hello, I'm RetroZuki81. Yes. <laughs> it is getting cold outside. Um, thinking about uh, maybe sometimes wearing a shimmer jacket in the winter. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah, I forgot. Uh, and maybe it was last year or the year before. Oh, uh, I had my hair like in a, in a ponytail. Uh, <laughs> sometimes, you know, I just don't know what to do with my hair. It grows fast sometimes. And uh, even though the hairline may be receding, you know, like uh, it may be receding somewhat, but I don't think my hair really looks that bad, you know? Uh, it cut down the volume somewhat. But cut it out. Actually, oh, uh, I won't say. I won't even say about that line. Cut it out. That's what uh, Ryuzuki says to Mark, the, the the harbor worker. It's funny because I kind of know more or less some some things about the the lines that are even said in Shenmue. And I'm not just saying that because I actually have experience saying some of these lines myself in school. Now, under intellectual property law and, you know, patentee law, all that stuff, I don't want to just divulge these things, you know, honestly. And uh, I know I'm already in the group. My numbers are, are going up from the Shenmue uh, for my, you know, for my channel, like uh, for RetroZuk81. So I don't just want to say everything that I you know, speculate or, or think I might know, um, cut it out. <laughs> so, yes, um, is that too loud? Maybe not. Okay. So I'm thinking about maybe wearing my jacket outside sometimes around here. I don't know. You know, it'd be cool to do it because, um, uh, you know, I just think it'd be cool to do it anyway. I'm kind of letting myself go a little lately. Um, wanting to build my channel up somehow. Uh, looking for new content, you know. Um, wanting to really build the channel more and more with subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed to me yet already, please do so. I am RetroRuzik81. And... Uh, yeah, you know, I like using my hands. Sometimes I just use my hands. I'm a visual learner. I'm a audible learner sometimes, but I learn more sometimes with my hands and my, you know, visually. Um, all around, I'm a pretty cool guy. Um, yes. Okay, so uh, uh, starting out fresh today, I'm not going to make this video too long. Um, I'm just watching this uh, Shenmue, uh, the classical version, classical version of uh, the orchestra. Like uh, that's what I meant to say, <laughs> classical version. That's funny because I I actually remember having this karate teacher that uh, told me to listen to classical music, and that's that's kind of why I would think of this, think of the classical music, you know. Um. Uh, you know, going back in my time, you know, I can't say I had all the, the right support for karate and uh, for my parents and my teachers. They didn't really collaborate the, like like they do with, with school, you know. Some people, you know, they're just so, um, you know, they're so much from a different generation. Uh, it just doesn't work that way. Think of it in terms as like as the show Leave It to Beaver, okay? Leave It to Beaver. Um, who am I to say? You know, those are classy parents or old fashioned, and maybe sometimes people just don't want to say nothing about you know uh, something at all, and they just don't want their kids you know maybe having anything to do with uh, the teachers or whatever, um, you know. I don't know who am I to say. 
sometimes and you know i you know i don't know if you really if people can really uh, identify with this but there's been instances like even in martial arts where sometimes students may have some kind of issue with teachers um uh, it doesn't have to be you know karate school but it could be any type of school teachers are not always perfect okay but uh yes anyway i want to touch on that subject here i'm starting out with a cup of coffee Uh, at five minutes going on six I think I put too much cream in it it's hazelnut better health coffee I put too much cream <laughs> it's too much but it is good and I'm drinking it this morning Yes, so um, there's a store, it's like a health food store, it's called the Better Health Market. They're a great store, I um, highly recommend it. If you're in Michigan, come down here, shop at the Better Health Market, you'll find whatever you're looking for. If it's uh, health related, you're gonna find it. Great store, great, great store. I'm very much a fan of it. And uh, any health food store. You know, it's like, uh, if there's a health food store, I'm there, I'm there, I'm there, you know, yeah. Um, so, uh, wanting to present this video with, uh, uh, okay, this is the title of my, my video and I'm just gonna, uh, um, I kind of forgot. I keep get, get going to my conversation and I want to get this long into the video. And uh, forget what my conversation is going to be about. Uh, yes. Okay. Um, well, actually, it'll be the next video, the following video. I'm going to have a part two of this one. And this one will be uh, completing the, the, part, the part two. Because <laughs> I know last time I kind of had a falling out with uh, the part uh, two of that video. So I'm going to uh, I'm gonna fall in, stay in, and uh, finish the part two. And the theme of this video is uh, introduction to part two, or I don't know what it's going to be. It'd be it's like an introductory. Uh, um, it, it's it, this is like a update update of um. Oh, I'll say it two times. Okay, I'm trying to to really uh, present myself correctly. I know there's people online that have a lot of more experience than I do. Now I want to say uh, this is uh, part one of a. Uh, part two i'll just call it that part one of part two because i don't know what to call it really <laughs> yeah okay uh, yes now this video for shenmue uh regarding you know related to shenmue i was just saying you know um uh, i gave like a maybe a secret about or or kind of hinting on something that i might know about shenmue and uh i'm also um uh, Speaking about wearing a Shemu jacket, um, yes. You ever notice that that Tiger is like a cyclone kick? Really? Ryuzuki's jumping around doing a cyclone kick. But you notice that the claws are different. The claws are pointing differently. And I'll tell you more about that next time. It, um, if there is a next time. I, I said it before in a previous video, but if you notice that claws, those claws, they're like pointed the opposite uh, direction. And, uh, well, that would mean, uh, or, or is it the claws or is it the paws? Maybe it's the paws or pointing the opposite direction. I remember I, I figured something out for myself that I personally believe about the paw and the paws and the, and the claws on the, the, the Shemu jacket, because, uh, that's the, the second Shemu jacket. Um, the reason I say that's the second Shemu jacket, and they don't tell you this, because I'm the guy that was presented the first Shenmue jacket. And um, I didn't accept it being the spiritual martial artist that I that I was. Um, and I say spiritual, that mostly means meditation. That means uh, devotion to the martial arts and being a good uh, human being. And overall being inspired by 
the martial arts and inspiring others as such as integrity. Having that inspiration can make you uh, uh, formidable and uh, very much um, a reputable, good person, um, formidable martial artist, or should I rather say, uh, the iconic martial arts sensation of what you're supposed to be depicted to be. If you're that kind of person, um, <clears throat> you might, you know, you might as well be wearing like, come on, kind of like a, almost like a cape, you know, um, it's like, I might as well be wearing a Batman cape or, or some kind of Superman, Superman, Batman. I, I don't know what to say. Because when you do these martial arts, you feel that power, you feel the sensation, the rush and the adrenaline really gets into you. Um, I haven't been working out like I've been wanting to lately, but I have been meaning to get these things done. It's just, uh, fact is, um, the facts are, is that financially I've been having some problems and, um, uh, you know, maybe my spirits are not what they should be. And when my spirits are doing better, I would be doing better as a human being and a martial artist and a good man. Um. Now, okay, so what I wanted to say here, um, what I wanted to say, um, oh, okay, giving the title of the next video, we're at 11 minutes now, I'm going on 12, <laughs> 11.55, 12, coming up, approaching. <laughs> Yes. Okay, so I wanted to say uh, the title of the next video will be... Um, okay, this is the title. I just forgot it. I forget it and forget it. Here's the title. The title of the next video will be uh, Part 2, My Experience Online as Retro Rizuki 81. <laughs>